Today, let's take a look at a very special kind of amethyst. It is called Veracruz amethyst. In English, it is usually referred to as Veracruz amethyst. The name comes from its place of origin, Veracruz in Mexico. So, what makes Veracruz amethyst unique? First of all, it is quite different from the common amethysts found in Brazil or Uruguay. Its color is softer, often pale purple to lavender. The crystals are highly transparent, giving them a clear and pure appearance. Another interesting feature is the color gradient. The purple shade usually gets darker toward the tip of the crystal. The crystals are often slender in shape, and sometimes they grow in small clusters, attached to white host rock. Because production is limited, Veracruz amethyst is considered rare in the market, especially those crystals that are complete, transparent, and with naturally sharp terminations, are valued highly by collectors. In terms of energy and symbolic meaning, many people say Veracruz amethyst has a very high vibration. It is often used for meditation and for better sleep. It can help calm the mind quickly, and is also said to ease anxiety and stress. Of course, such spiritual effects may vary from person to person. From a scientific point of view, Veracruz amethyst is still a type of amethyst, mainly composed of silicon dioxide. Its purple color comes from trace iron elements and geological processes. So, how can we choose a good piece of Veracruz amethyst? Generally, a soft, elegant color without cloudiness, high transparency and a well-formed crystal are considered ideal features. But keep in mind that dyed or synthetic pieces may also exist on the market. For crystal lovers, when you come across Veracruz amethyst, take a closer look at its clear and graceful beauty. That's all for today's sharing. Don't forget to follow me. And let's continue to learn more about gemstones and crystals together.